Hello everybody, this is Flakeplier, and welcome to This is My Psoriasis. But seriously, you know, if, uh, if you don't like to see psoriasis, or you don't want to see something that may potentially, you know, turn your stomach, you might want to look away. Well, actually, my name is Hui No, uh, also known as Flaky Boy or Soraya Samurai. Um, and uh, let's just jump into it. Uh, let's take a look at some of the various psoriasis patches that I have. Um, I've got about, I don't know, I'd say six different spots. Uh, the front of my, bleh, bleh, excuse me, uh, my right arm right here. This, uh, this is one of those stubborn areas where the psoriasis grows and doesn't quite flake off the way it normally should. Uh, the only way it really comes off is by either soaking it and scrubbing it. And uh, ew, I don't know. It, that that uh, it's kind of it's kind of hard. It, it's very hard, and it's and it's itchy. But the problem with scratching it is that these parts are very prone to bleeding if uh, if I scratch enough. And yeah, I don't I don't really like it that much. Uh, here is a shot of me cleaning it with the pumice stone after soaking. So as you can see, quite a drastic difference there. Um, you know, you can see a few spots that look a little raw, but nothing too crazy. This is my left arm, more of the same. You'll see uh, a bunch of, uh, basically that stubborn psoriasis, I call it. Uh, and it's just, it just doesn't want to come off at all. It's kind of rough, you know, nasty, nasty business that. Uh, and then we're going to come on to me uh, scrubbing it after I scrubbed it. And don't worry about uh, the video. I'll, I'll have some video for you later uh, of me actually scrubbing it. Okay, so moving along now, we've got my left, uh, my left shin and calf. Um, and essentially, this 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 spot is it, it produces a much different uh, type of psoriasis. It is very uh, flaky for the most part. And then we move along to the back and the side. Um, we've got the back part which is more like the psoriasis on the forearm where it's very, very stubborn. It's hard to, 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 to pick off. And as you can see uh, around this area, we've got a little bit of uh, uh, redness that I picked myself uh, a little too much. Um, and here is after a soak and scrub, a little more, and a little more on the back area. looks pretty good overall as you can see there's some leftovers right here and there and then now we're moving on to my right leg this is the my right shin uh, uh, more of the flaky stuff this is this is where we get most of uh, most of the big flakes from a little close up there as you can see this the weirdo texture of the skin as it uh, as it flakes upon itself and there's a shot of me after I scrubbed it down, you can see a couple of a couple of spots of blood. And now this is this is the the worst spot I have in the back of my right calf. A little blurry there, but we'll focus in a little bit. And there we go. Look at that. You can see a little bit of discoloration there because I had uh, scratched and, and bled a little bit on that. And it was, you know, no matter how much you wash it, it's hard to get that blood out. And here's the back after scrubbing it down. Looks pretty cool. And there it is again. All right, that's uh, that's that's about all I've got for you guys. Thank you very much for tuning in for this. I just wanted to kind of to show what my psoriasis looks like without me picking at it, flake, uh, scraping it, or doing anything else to it. So after uh, after this, the next video we probably have will be the pumice stone video, and I look forward to seeing you guys in a couple of days. Talk to you soon. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And if you want a notification, hit that little bell and, uh, and you'll get a notification straight to your phone and you can watch my video as soon as it comes out. We'll catch you later, all right? Take care now. Bye-bye.